And I know some people find it so hard to hold a conversation with people and they might think that, oh, Sammy, this is not going to work for me. I don't even know what to ask people to have a conversation going. And guess what? That's why I'm here. I'm going to help you today. You can have more than you have, but you can become more than you are. But unless you change who you are, then you can't have what you want. Then I guess instead of focusing on what you want, why would you become the person that qualifies to have what you want? Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Sammy. I'm back again with another video. In today's video, we're going to talk about a very interesting topic. And today we are going to talk about the art of dealing with people. The people you know and the ones you are yet to meet. People are primarily interested in themselves. I want you to take a look at your environment, your friends, those close to you. Have you realized that anytime you're going to talk to somebody... They are always talking about themselves. Like literally, all they say is about them. And I know some people will say, no, me, I don't really talk about myself, blah, blah, blah. But I want you to do this social experiment. Go out there, go speak to somebody. And because you know this now, just keep in mind that you are trying to figure out if they will talk about themselves. And let me know. Come back to this video and put it in the comment section. And guess what? Even you, you like talking about yourself. And listen, I'm not saying it's a bad thing. Okay. okay, It's not a bad thing. But then having this knowledge that people are primarily interested in themselves will help you so much. Because it will help you to get the skills in order to influence them to do what you want. Now, this trait is so strong and deeply rooted in our minds that the dominant factor when it comes to even people who do charity, charitable events, stuff that go on, the, the dominant thought is for the giver to have the satisfaction of giving. Not even giving the, like, not the good that the, the gift is going to do for the other person. I know when the vid happened, right, you probably hear, I mean, you heard that um, Jeff Bezos gave this amount of money to this guy and i mean this country elon musk gave this huge amount of money to this country and blah 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 and you think oh these are good people they just want to help and trust me whatever they did is a good act okay but then the first thing that comes into their minds is for them to satisfy that part of themselves okay they want to fulfill that that's very thin in their lives which is feeling important okay being the person that people look up to so now when they do that what comes second is whatever the gift does to the other person but then the first thought is trying to satisfy that human need okay of feeling important Okay, now the next thing I want to talk about is how to skillfully talk to people. And this is a tip. When you're talking to somebody, okay, pick out the most interesting thing to them and talk about it. You realize some magical stuff happening. You realize that all they say is about themselves. They will literally tell you everything just by picking out their interest. Now, when you talk to them about what interests them, they'll be deeply interested in the conversation. And trust me, they will like you so much just because you said something that is so important to them. And I know some people find it so hard to hold a conversation with people and they might think that, oh, Sammy, this is not going to work for me. I don't even know what to ask people to have a conversation going. And guess what? That's why I'm here. I'm going to help you today. Okay. Now I want you to write this down. Questions. For those who feel like they can't hold a conversation for long. I want you to write this down. Questions. Is it questions or questions? I don't know. 
whichever one it is but you know what i mean right now questions are very powerful okay questions come in two forms when it comes to skillfully talking to people number one ask people questions about themselves and the second one is repeat people's words and just throw it back at them for those who can hold a conversation so when it comes to questions about people it's so simple you can just meet somebody in the hallway of your apartment and you can go like hey i like your shirt where do you get your shirt from it really looks good on you and guess what the person will say well i probably got to let's say fashion over i don't shop from fashion over but that's what just came to my head because i know somebody who is always there and she's looking at me right now okay so fashion over okay and you'll be like oh you got it from fashion over and they'll go like yeah i got it for, from fashion over i even got it on sale for let's say twenty dollars then you'll be like oh you got it for twenty dollars and they'll keep answering questions okay this is because you're asking them questions about what is so important to them so that's the first one now i even did the second strategy in the first one but i'll show you guys now so the second one is repeating people's words to them okay so just as the fashion over thing let me give a different example let's say dennis is my friend and i am sammy obviously right so dennis goes like hey sammy how are you doing today and i'm like yeah i'm good how about you dennis and then dennis goes like uh, i'm not feeling too good um, i had to go to work and take care of some stuff and this is what i'm going to do i'm not going to say anything but repeat dennis words to him oh you had to go to work today and you had to take care of some stuff then dennis would be like oh yeah i went to work and my manager was like down my throat today and i'm i'm literally tired of this job and this is what sam is going to say oh so your manager is really annoying you today and you really want to quit your job right then this is what dennis is going to say oh yeah i'm i'm thinking of even starting a business then some of you'll be like oh you really want to start a business right so have you realized that i'm not saying any new thing i'm just repeating their words to them okay no new thing so for the, those of you who can't hold a conversation this is a tip for you okay just repeat people's words to them and because the thing is people don't know you are doing this now you know it so try it. just just do the social experiment you realize how powerful it is yeah and sometimes we do it without even knowing and if you watch this video to the end i'm going to give you guys some tips i mean guys not girls so girls when it gets when it gets to that point i need you to pause the video and go and watch the other videos because i don't want you to know the secret okay yeah so that's about it guys i'll continue in the next video so if you want to know more i know you guys are enjoying this right now but if you want to know more just go hit the bell and you know put your your notifications on so that you get notified as soon as i post i have so much for you guys i have so much this summer you guys are really going to enjoy these videos and guys what i want you guys to know that's little secrets for girls okay i want you to watch the next video and everything will be there for you don't worry the girls will not get the opportunity to watch this and the girls don't worry i love you guys too i'll do something for you so just watch out okay like comment subscribe to the channel don't just come watch and leave subscribe so that we help the channel grow so that we can get to the ten thousand we can get to the fifty thousands you know you can get the plaques and everything so yeah that's about it love you guys catch you guys on another video peace i'm out and my 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 buddy that takes the videos all the time said him his name is said him he always says that I never play with my okay. So, guys, anytime you hear me say okay, put okay in the comments, okay?